welcome back to my channel. My name is Michaela, and today we're going to be testing out some viral TikTok, um, pretty much like beauty hacks. I have literally been seeing so many beauty hacks on TikTok because I've just been flicking through TikTok like anything, and I really wanted to test out some like hacks that I've seen. So I'm just going to get the elephant out of the room. Yes, this is a wig. This is not actually my hair. Like I wish my hair was this long, but this is a, um, a wig from Freedom Couture. It did cost me an arm and a leg, but it's well worth it because I love wearing it. It's so comfortable and so luxurious. You can see on my Instagram, if you go follow me on there, you can see how I style it and stuff, but this is not about the wig. Um, but yeah, I'm going to test out some... TikTok beauty hacks and I really hope you enjoy this video. I hope you guys are all staying safe out there as well or social distancing. I know I am. That's why I'm making these videos for you guys to keep you entertained because I know I'm so bored at home. I have been watching everyone on YouTube, but definitely please subscribe to my channel. That will really help me out. I am trying to grow as much as I can and get my videos out there. So if you want to share them, please share them. That'd be like, that'd be really lovely of you if you do that. That'd be so nice of you. And definitely go follow me on all my social medias, especially Instagram. That is where I post all my content. Uh, but yeah, let's get into the video and I'll show you guys these beauty hacks. So I did save these beauty hacks on my phone. So this is the first one. Moisturize first. Then after moisturizing, take some translucent powder. I usually use the Fit Me one and I just lightly dab it all over my face, not too much. Then take some setting spray, it could be any setting spray. I usually use the NYX one. After the setting spray, take a primer and just put your primer. Also wait for the setting spray to dry first. Then just put on your foundation and just see what happens and how amazing your fucking makeup is gonna look. And it's gonna stay on 24 seven and it's not gonna crease. Um, yep, yeah, okay, cool. Like, I love how she put the F word in there, but you know. <laughs> Um, so yeah, so what she did was she put, um, a moisturizer on and then she put a setting spray and then, no, sorry. She put moisturizer on and then she put a translucent powder over the top and then her setting spray. I think that's right. I can't remember. Oh my God. It was literally like five minutes ago, but. Change so. your whole routine and try this instead. Moisturize moisturizer first. and after moisturizing take some translucent powder I okay so translucent powder then setting spray and then your primer and then your um foundation which sounds absolutely very very weird um that just sounds like a cakey mess but i'm gonna try it because you know i want to see how it goes and see if it is actually good and if it is it might be my new holy grail um but you know, don't mind my breakouts and everything at the moment. I'm going through pregnancy hormones and eating chocolate. Ooh. Um, <laughs> so <sighs> yeah. Okay. Let's um, grab a primer and let's grab translucent powder and all that kind of jazz. Okay. So I'm going to do like a TikTok as well while I'm doing this because <laughs> I'm just a little bit extra, but I got the same, um, so the Summer Fridays jet lag mask is what she used in her, um, pretty much her video. So I'm going to use this as my moisturizer. I love this stuff. It feels so nice. And then she put a translucent um, powder. So I've got the Laura Mercier powder. Um, that's the same one that they used as well. And I'm just going to, this feels so weird, dust this all over my face. I'll put this all over. This is such a weird concept for me right now. I feel so weird. The MAC Prep and Prime. And then they let that kind of like dry. So after the setting spray, it said take a primer. So I'm just going to take the um, Too Faced primer. 
and put that all over my face. And then I'm going to go in with my foundation, which is the Laura Mercier Flawless Fusion Foundation in Buff. And I'm just going to apply that with a beauty blender and see how this goes and see if it's going to give me a flawless, flawless look. Okay, so I will say that my foundation is feeling cakey, um, but, you know, like it is full, looks very full coverage. Um, but yeah, I can just, I can feel the foundation on my skin. Like with this foundation, I really don't need much to like, like I really feel like I need to hydrate my skin like crazy um but if you want that flawless like i don't even know like it does look really nice i will say it does look really nice on my skin um it just looks like i need a tone maybe trying a different foundation might be a little bit better but I'm not, I'm not hating it. It looks really nice on camera. Like I will say, it looks very nice on camera. It looks nice in person as well. Um, like, yeah. Yeah. I wonder how well, like if it will cake up during the day though. That's the only thing. But I'm going to try the next, um, next beauty hack so this is the only other hack that i have um and that is so the makeup hack is fake freckles now i did see this one and i thought it was really cool so Okay, so basically what she did was um, she got pretty much setting spray, put it in the cap, and then she kind of like flicked it onto her skin with the setting spray, with the powder. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to do the rest of my makeup, and then um, I'll come back and do that trend. Okay, now that I've finished my makeup and looking nice and... <laughs> Glam. I just did a TikTok too because, you know, I wanted to do one of them. Um, but I'm going to do the faux freckles. So hopefully this doesn't ruin my makeup, but okay. Um, so it just said get some like, like a lid and some setting spray and just put the setting spray in the cap and then get like, a bronzer so I got the hula bronzer and then kind of like swirl that in there and then just sticking that in there this is gonna be very very weird I'm gonna leave a lot more I'm like really trying here but it's just like I don't know what's going on all right Let's have a look. Let's see how I go. <laughs> I don't know if that's working. I don't know if I put too much um, stuff in the cap. Um... I don't know. I see like one little freckle over here. I'm going to try. Let's go. Okay, I'm going to try this again, but I'm not going to put that much. Um, what is it? Setting spray in there. 
So I'm just gonna like put a little bit of setting spray. I keep losing my brush. Um, you know, it'd be just easier for me to just like grab a, you know, pencil and just do this because that looks 100% better already. I'm going to give this one like a flop like I see a little bit of there like some but it just looks like there's like weird speckles on my face and it just looked very weird so I'm going to like fix up my own little Freckles, like literally like I just get like a pen tool or like I use my brow is and I just place little dots on my face and then I just get like I just take like my beauty blender wet it a little bit and just kind of like Dab that in and it looks 100% better already. You probably can't see it that far away, but yeah. Okay, so they are my two beauty hacks. Well, TikTok beauty hacks that went viral on the internet. So, you know, I will say the first one with the foundation, I noticed like my skin looks really nice, but I'm noticing already my face is going a little bit cakey. Yeah. Just like little bits of areas. And then the, um, what is it? The, the faux freckles. Like, I don't know. I think that's just a waste of like mucking around and stuff. So I reckon just getting like a brow wiz or a, br or a pencil or a brown pencil and just dabbing them on and then going over with your beauty blender. They look so much nicer and actually look like freckles. Um, but other than that... I tested them out because I kept seeing them all over TikTok and I wanted to see if they actually work and I want to show you guys if they actually worked and I don't know, don't even waste your time. Like keep doing um, your own foundation the way you are doing. Like if you want to test it out and see how it goes, then you can. But the faux freckle one, pff, just get a pencil. It's so much easier. Other than that, thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoyed me mucking around with all this stuff but i hope you enjoyed and i will see you guys next time bye